All right, what's up with the Charles? Your boy Rock. You see what it is? Finally back with another video. You see right here, we got uh, LeBron and, and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And on this one, man, uh, I just wanted to discuss this real quick video. Um, but, you know, so LeBron recently up on side of his uh, Instagram. I'm going to pull it up right now. Right here on his Instagram, y'all see this is LeBron James' Instagram. It's fresh. You see, got fresh stories. Um, but the other day, and it blew me away that he actually put this on his Instagram. And I'm still surprised. But you go right here. And look what it say. You got CV-19, cold, flu. They all looking the same, pointing at each other. And, uh, you know, that's just a question everybody's having right now. I know, you know, the holidays just passed the other day. You know, it's, it's been a while for me. Happy holidays to everybody. Um, you know, whatever you celebrate. But uh, it, it seemed like this year, and it, it did for me, it, you know, it seemed like uh, the CV-19, it, it, it ruined my holiday. And I'm looking around on the Internet Seemed like it ruined a lot of other people's holiday. And what I'm thinking is it must have ruined uh, part of LeBron's uh, holiday, you know. Because that's the first thing. I, I, first, I don't know what date he put this up on. This is like three days old. But it's just something I want to talk about because, yeah, he said, help me out, folks. And he, you see everybody, everybody pointing at each other. But the crazy part about it is Kareem Abdul-Jabbar comes out. And he, he comes out basically blasting LeBron for it. So far as to the point that I didn't know that Kareem had his own website. You go to uh, KareemSubstack.com, and this is it looked like it's official Kareem Substack. So I guess Substack is a uh, shared thoughts on sports, uh, politics, and popular culture, and how they define America. Okay, so it's just something that it looks like that Kareem does. But bam, right here. So you go all the way down, and he's just going in on LeBron talking about. You know, he's uh, uninformed, which obviously, I mean, everybody doesn't have the facts. I mean, let, let's let's be honest. Right now with the whole facts with this whole CV-19, everything keeps changing every day. You know what I mean? You know, they just fi finally came out and said that it only takes, after you get it and you 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 get back better, uh, build back better. <laughs> uh, when you get back better, though, uh, that it's only a 10 day wait or I, I saw five and then I saw now it's only 10 days. Something about the CDC is changing it up. Me personally, I was think I'm thinking that they're tired of paying these people two weeks off from work. They trying to figure out a way to get them back to work quicker. Um, that's what I think. But let me know in the comments, man, especially, you know, since you clicked on this video, just check this out. Did, did this whole thing mess up? Mess up your Christmas, you know, because a lot of people that I see that that supposedly got this, uh, I guess it's a new name, uh, uh, Omarion variant, you know what I'm saying? I don't know which one it is now, but do y'all know? It seemed like everyone I knew knew somebody that was sick from it. Me personally, I knew people by, I was personally sick from it. It messed up our, it messed up our, uh, you know, normal Christmas and we had to, I basically had to spend it at home with my my family that I'm always at home with, you know, we usually come together, but that wasn't the case this year. Um, but yeah, man, I just kind of want to discuss this, but I'm really surprised that, that Kareem would do this, especially seeing that Kareem Abdul-Jabbar is a Muslim and y'all know me, y'all know I went with the whole religious exemption as far as my job. And it's crazy to me. I would think uh, Kareem would be more on the side of an Andrew Wiggins, um, you know, not, not wanting to, to put stuff in his body. You know, it seems like, uh, Kareem used to be an advocate for the black community on, you know, certain things like this, because let's get it. Let's keep it straight and keep it 100. This is still a test. We've had cancer and AIDS around for I don't know how long. And then CV-19 come around. Then five minutes later, you already got a jab for it. And you trying to make everybody take it. It just don't make no sense, man. It really don't make no sense to me. Let me know what y'all think. It's been your boy Rock. Definitely more videos to come. I just want to do a short video right now, man. I at least get my feet wet, you know. Uh, it, it's easy to fall off of doing these YouTube videos. Trust me. I'm, I'm definitely get back. Appreciate everybody that stuck around. I'll catch y'all on the next video.